Hi there guys, this is Nikhil from Greedy Tech and these are the 20 things that you need to know about the Reliance Geo. So let's start off with the exciting stuff. First we have free voice calls and SMS, 1 GB of data which will cost you just 50 rupees. Geo SMS is free on blackout days like Diwali, Dasara. From 5th September anyone can get it easily. Anyone who buys the Geo SIM will get the welcome offer which is free till December 31st. Students will get 25% additional data. Once again, no blackout days, no roaming throughout India. But here's the catch. First, free voice calling. You can't call it voice calling to be precise. It's voice over LTE. So your phone need to have Vo LTE support enabled to make free calls. Or else you need to enable 4G mobile data to make calls. If you don't have Vo LTE, it'll drain your battery if you use 4G. So far based on our research, data consumed on voice calls will not be considered as 4G data. So that's at least a little good thing. Next we have 1 GB of data for 50 rupees. So that's what Mr. Mukesh Ambani said. But if we look at the current plans or the plans that they have released, there is no proof of this. The cheapest plan is for 149 rupees which gives us 300 MB of 4G data. I won't say it's a lie, but I don't see any proof of it either. It's more like a marketing term to make people go crazy. Because there's no such plan where you actually get 1 GB of 4G data for just 50 rupees, I'll just say, well played Reliance. Next, Geo SMS are free, free, free. Seriously, who among you using a smartphone in 2016 choose to send an SMS instead of a WhatsApp or Facebook message? I'm not saying it's useless. It has its perks, but it is nothing too much to be hyped while talking about Digital India. Mr. Mukesh Ambani said you get Geo SIM in 15 minutes with an Aadhaar card. But as per your Indian consumer and many other YouTubers, that's not the case. At least not as of now anyway. Next, each Reliance SIM outlet has limited SIM cards ranging from 20 to 50. So they are giving away tokens for specific dates. You need to go to the store on the specific date with the token with your ID proof and address proof to get the SIM. Once again, this might not happen everywhere, but this is what is happening in Hyderabad. Next, Reliance said we will get unlimited 4G in welcome offer. But that's only limited to 4GB per day and after that it will drop to 128kbps. I'm pretty sure any normal person wouldn't use more than that unless you are downloading stuff from torrents. So though it's a limitation, it's still a pretty good offer. Next, Reliance offers unlimited 4G at night for plans above 499 rupees. But Reliance considers only 2 am to 5 am as night, only 3 hours. So it's very rare that you'll be able to take advantage of it. Next we don't have any official statement but everyone who got the GeoSIM before 5th and who got it on and after 5th September will be included in the Geo welcome plan. That's just a hypothesis but it might be possible. So people who are enjoying the preview offer will be thrown onto the welcome plan which basically has 4 GB per day limit. Next comes the Geo apps. We have different Geo apps which are ranked as top free apps on Google Play Store very quickly. They have their perks and can be used for free of cost till December 31st. By the way, using these apps will consume your data too. Next, Reliance has reduced the price of Geo Mi 5 to 2000 rupees, which is something I would suggest you to buy. It's a portable Wi-Fi hotspot with 4G speeds. It can last you 7 hours of usage with its inbuilt battery and because of this, your phone battery will not drain. As for me, I'm going to use it for my home internet till Jan 1st. Let's hope it delivers consistent speeds. By the way, we can make calls via the Mi 5 using the Geo app installed on our phones. Next, we can port our number to Geo starting from January 1st, 2017. Not as of now anyway. But with that said, I would suggest you to wait until Feb or March till we get a complete grasp of the network quality and then you can switch to Reliance Geo. Till then use it as your secondary sim. And finally, everyone seems to be really shocked about free voice calls, but this is not all that new. It's already available in US carriers like AT&T and Verizon. So if you're wondering if you should get it or not, as of now considering the welcome offer and the fact that it is completely free, definitely the answer is yes. It is slightly a pain to go stand in the line and buy it but it's definitely worth it. It's free, speeds are real, so go get it. Use it as your secondary sim till Jan 1st and you can probably ditch it after that if you're not satisfied with the call quality and other stuff. 
as of now the welcome offer is really good and it is free so that's it guys these are the 20 things that you should probably everyone should know about so share this video with your friends and family to let them know what geo is all about so that's it guys thanks for watching this video if you have any more doubts do let me know by commenting below this video and i'll try to get back to you as soon as possible if you like this video hit that like button and stay tuned to us by subscribing to our channel and i'll catch up with you in my next video until then have a nice day